kind of keeping up with the with the trend for today or whatever. Um, this is because I just did the video about the uh, about the fall of O Block. That's a glare in my glasses because of this light. My bad. Um, so this video is by Dramatic, I believe, one on one. Is this is this the YouTube name or is this the Instagram or some shit? I don't know. Anywho, um, yeah, it's called Horrific Slash Gruesome Deaths in Chicago Part One. It's pretty dark. Um, I don't know why I'm reacting to this. Um, kind of cause I don't know. I just want to see more information about stuff like this. Um, I know that it's a lot. As you can see, it's like a part one, so it's probably gonna be like at least two, three parts to this shit, just because Chicago is so violent, um, and it's a lot of deaths. So, um, just and just by listening from songs, you know, Chicago known for dissing um, dead ox and shit in their songs. So even just listen to the song, you'll you'll catch on and you will hear like. Oh, such and such got done what way? Damn, they they killed him how? They fucked him up how? Just by listening to the song. You don't even be trying to you don't even be trying to get no information. You just trying to listen to the song. You get told all types of shit about somebody death. Like, damn. Like, okay. That's how it was when I listened to um Exposing Me, the um um Duck and Ruger version. I'm like, oh, I just came here to listen. I'm I'm I got a whole motherfucking lecture i got a whole bunch of information about how 12 niggas died in what way like it's crazy that's just how they that's just how chicago these songs are like totally different level compared to everybody else but here we go uh horrific gruesome deaths in chicago part one by i guess drill dramatic 101 like i'm subscribe Cookie. Big Cookie, who was a fear BD and hit man for the bees, was shot 18 times and ran over it twice by a vehicle and then spat on. Damn. 18 times and y'all ran him over and y'all gonna spit on him? He was, oh, he was well dead. He was well dead after the first time they ran him over and y'all still gonna spit on him. That's fucked up. RIP to you, Big Cookie. Twenty ten, uh, OJ and Deontay Coleman, aka Lil D, were both in the were abducted from a party and placed in the trunk. Not abducted. Rumors are they were stripped naked and shot in the back of the head and placed on the train track. This shit is sad. I don't, I don't. I shouldn't have reacted to this. This is fucked up. I'm just thinking it's gonna be like multiple shots. My, people getting abducted, not the females. 17 year old Sharina Jefferson was eight months pregnant, was walking home from a corner store with a man who was a lot to remember. Sharina's and her friends stopped to talk to some friends. That's when a guy named Timmy Jones, that kid came home, was 18 years old. Remember the scrap girl pulled up in the car and hopped out with a nine millimeter handgun. Y'all ain't even had to do that to her. Like what was what was the point? You gonna kill me I'm pregnant. Shot her in the head. And he shot her again and again. That is beyond fucked up. Fuck you. Um, that's bogus as fuck. Timo, Timo, whoever did that, that's bogus as hell. Oh, they was able to rescue the son. Is is did Timo did Timo go to jail or did he did somebody catch him for that? couldn't see or hear from days after death 
as you sh fucking should. You sick ass man. Sick as fuck. Yeah, 90 years. Released in 2100. 21. Fucking sick. Get 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 them off. Get them off the screen. Mm -mm. Oh hey, yeah. I done heard this name before. Thirty-three year old Michael Knowles, okay, oh here along with two of his friends were in the home playing video games and convicted killer Kurt Davis, who were former friends of oh hit shows at the home and killed him along with his two friends. Thirty-three times are y'all fucking kidding me? Thirty-three times, thirty-three. Fat head, hurt him. Antonio Davis. Walking to a store with his female cousin when a passenger from a van had shot him in his back. His cousin then ran and turned around to see the shooter got the band and stand over him and shoot him multiple times in the face. You know how what the fuck? You know how sick you gotta be to stand over somebody and shoot him in the face multiple times? Like you, you a sick individual. That means you have no empathy. I left his home when he would be approached by a vehicle in the alley and shot to the ground. Like, that is sick. Like, I don't know. Exactly. Exactly. Couldn't, his people couldn't even identify him properly because you done shot his face off. That's sick as fuck. Can't even have an open casket. Y'all sick. I did some sick shit. Ain't the word for that blood, blood, bludgeoned, bludgeoned to them. Y'all beat him with a boulder. And he had, I don't even want to watch this no more. He had a mental disability. Over $5. Y'all beat a man head in with a fucking rock for $5. Not, oh my God. Oh, 89. 89 years old. Uh, I'm done with this video. Yeah, horrific indeed. Gruesome indeed. Do some sick ass shit. What goes through your mind to stab an 89 year old woman? Not once. That's like multiple times. It ain't gonna steal her, ain't gonna steal her shit. And then set her house on fire. Fucked up. Please tell me they got the motherfucker who did this. Please let, let us see what you look like. Eighteen. Eighteen. What'd they give him? Oh, he's still waiting trial. Sick. Sick fuck.
fucking Elaine old. Overkill. What? <laughs> took turns. They took turns shooting them in the face. That's shooting in the face shit. That is. And then y'all took pictures. Whether it was them or whether it was the people who came across the body. If you take a picture and then you post that shit online, I hate when people do that. They take pictures of fucking the deceased in horrific ways and post it online. And I'll get on that. With a screwdriver? What the fuck? That's sick as fuck. This all, everybody on this. Everybody on this list is fucking sick, but y'all sat with a screwdriver, set him on fire, and ran him over. Sick fuck, sick fuck, sick fuck, sick fuck. Uno, uno, dos, tres, cuatro, sick fuck. Yeah, then I ain't motherfucking bail. Yeah, Not Ben. My city full of them demons. They did him dirty as fuck. And I had no when I had when they had said he was missing, I had I wasn't even trying to be pessimistic, but I, I had just knew that they was not gone. I had him in good shape. Fucked up. Like I who would have thought? Really? BP gas station, pumping his gas and gun and got out of the car and shot Bobo. You already shot him. Why are you, why you gotta chase him? That shooting in the face shit is making me sick to my stomach. These people, families can't even have a open casket funeral because y'all are shooting them in their face. That shit ain't right. I'm sorry. It ain't right to kill anybody in general. Shoot anybody in general, but you shoot them in their face. That's overkill. It is beyond overkill. Oh yeah, they went overkill on him. Got him, he was coming out to jail. Dang, they had a video of him coming out to jail and literally what, 10 minutes later, if that? 64 times, 64 times. I think they hit his grandmama too on accident. Well, not on accident. Oh, his mother. Yeah. 
yes rest in peace to everybody mentioned in this video indeed this was some sick shit this video was very much depressing this video was very much um sick everybody on this list who did what they did is very much sick shooting people in their face sick um killing a killing a mentally disabled man or him, i think he was a boy actually killing the mentally challenged boy over five dollars and beating his head in with a fucking boulder fucking rock that's some sick ass shit um what stabbing an 89 year old woman to death selling her shit and setting her house on fire at the age of 18 that's some sick ass shit don't know what the fuck is happening with the with the development of the brain to even make you even consider doing some shit like that let alone to another person but to an elder to an elder that's some sick ass shit this video was sick as fuck um i have no faith in humanity i really do not um chicago gotta get together like seriously gotta get together because this this is this is ridiculous this is ridiculous so yeah um i don't know that was some sick shit so on that note um i am gone thanks for watching